At least you're the good kind of stalker, right? Here, we found more medical supplies. All yours. There's a guy over here. I want to ask him how he styles his hair. Just reported into the boss. He's still hey, Commander. I just wanted to say thank you. You're welcome, Garrus. I happen to go live right around the time that you get off? Gross. Cerberus is backing off for now. Make sure the scouts keep an eye out for the next attack. You've done an excellent job, Nyrene. But I'll be taking over now. You know what happens to people who argue with me. And if I say no? You'll just kill me and take over? My people won't stand for that. Yes, they do seem nauseatingly loyal. Either way, I'll get what I want. Not this time. The truth is, none of us can do this alone. Our only chance is to join forces. You might be right, but the people of Omega are my priority. You take over one gang and you think you're ready to decide what's best for Omega? Nyrene, watch and learn. As Everything's in place. The entire station's connected. People of Omega, I have returned. Cerberus believes they have beaten you. They believe they have you under control. They are gravely mistaken. You are the lawless of the galaxy. You cannot be beaten, and you will never be controlled. Be ready! Your chance to strike out against your oppressors is coming. Together we will take Omega back! That's your plan? Throw civilians at Cerberus? Anything is better than being locked up like mindless animals waiting for slaughter. I know what you're up to, Arya. And I don't like it. I have civilians to evacuate. I'll deal with this later. All right, let's get these people ready to go. Now! What are you trying to do? Trying? The people of Omega, my people, love a good street fight. When it breaks loose, they'll be ready. Nyrene's code of ethics won't let her sit by if civilians are exposed. It's what makes her utterly predictable, and therefore easy to manipulate. Cerberus is launching another offensive. Looks like I'm not the only one who didn't like your little speech, Arya. Glad I got his attention. Commander, landing pads are yours. My people and I will hold the main doors. Got it. Hello? Hi, Cappy. We're online. <laughs> Here we go. You love this whole DLC? All the DLC in Mass Effect 3 is really good. All the DLC in all three games are really good. This isn't my favorite, but that doesn't mean it's not good.
We're on our way. Yeah, uh, <clears throat> a lot of times when you say something like, this is my favorite DLC, what people hear is not what you say. So you say, like, this is my favorite DLC, and what people hear is, all other DLC sucks dick. And you're like, that's not what I said. <laughs> Talons will join your cause. Someone's got to make sure you don't run roughshod over our people. You see, Shepard. Let me guess. She said I was predictable and therefore easy to manipulate. Pretty much word for word. She thinks she's playing you. Nothing new here. One thing, though. I maintain command over my people. This is not up for debate. Just have them ready. Oh, they'll be ready. We're almost there, Shepard. The Talons will be the frontline fodder. Now we just need to bring down the force fields to clear the way to afterlife. Which will release Omega civilians. Cerberus will have a million fires to put out. In one fell swoop, we'll have the people in the Talons working for us. You might not want to compromise your alliance before it even takes shape. I've learned not to put much stock in truth and goodwill. It might be time to start again. Tell you what, I'll take it under advisement. Now, I'll be at the command console plotting our next move. Urgently, your attention, if you please. Hey, Mom. We need to bring you in fast. Rock, Rock, can you hear me? Damn it, Rock, don't do that again. I thought I loved you. Those are exactly what I needed. Thanks. Tentative excitement. Welcome to Herod's Emporium, human. Relieved. I am grateful for Arya's return. Hidden back room was getting confining. Her patrol liberated me. Cunningly. I have a plan to recoup my losses since the Cerberus takeover. Informative. The General threw out Arya's couch from Afterlife upon taking over. I would like to gain her favor by returning it. Temptingly. If you find it and send me the coordinates, I will make it worth your while. It's not a priority, but I'll keep my eyes open. Appreciative. Upon success, I will give you a finder's fee for your trouble. I'll let you know. Courteously, have a nice day. Take a look at my kiosk if you want to buy anything. Thank you. Uh...
Honestly, I don't. How are you holding up? Relax. I got this. I've blocked enemy access to critical areas. The frontal assault should be less treacherous. That's awesome. <clears throat> they think they have us trapped in here. They're in for a surprise, all right. If you had to rank the DLC, you would go Overlord, Omega, and Leviathan, Arrival and Shadow Broker, Firewalker, Bring Down the Sky, and Citadel. Uh, I would... I tend to agree with most of that. Uh, I would probably go Overlord... Overlord first, then Leviathan. Probably Shadow Broker. Omega. Bring Down the Sky. Citadel, Arrival, and then As Firewalker. Out notice. We're heading out soon. Firewalker was kind of eh. It didn't help that I didn't. I, it doesn't help Firewalker that I don't like the vehicle. Plus, there's not a lot of story there. It's basically just you exploring a lot of stuff, and then there's a little bit of story at the very end. Talk to but, me, Az. I'm located the source that's powering the Cerberus force fields. Yes, I see. Shepard, take a look at this. The General is siphoning power from one of my main reactors deep in the bowels of Omega's mines. Unfortunately. Access is cut off by the force fields themselves. Not completely. There's an open route through that dark area, then up. Hmm. The processing plant for one of the mines. It's been powered down. No force fields blocking it. We infiltrate there, find our way through the mine, then take that elevator to the reactor's back door. Good eyes, Shepard. Let's go. Not without me. Are you? My patrol caught her in the perimeter. Please. You didn't catch me. We're allies now. Didn't Arya tell you? Nyrene was expected, Bray. Return to your station. The Talons are ready, but if I'm sending my people into the breach, I want to make sure those force fields come down for good. So like it or not, you're stuck with me. It's almost as if you don't trust me. It's exactly as if I don't trust you. We're going to war together. I'll make sure we can rely on each other. Agreed, Commander. Glad one of you isn't on a power trip. Go wait by the med bay, Nyrene. We'll join you shortly. Shepard, I have last minute orders to dole out. I'll meet you there, too. Yeah, I am definitely not a fan of the yeah, sound so effect changes go. in Legendary, that's for sure. <clears throat> Shepard, somebody will, got a second? Somebody will make a mod for it that'll uh, return it to its original sound effect. I know time is short, but I was hoping we could talk. Alone. Arya will be joining us soon. Now may be our only chance. I'm not trying to undermine Arya. I know she has to be ruthless. Let her have revenge. I'm not doing this for me, and I'm not doing it for Arya or what we once had. It's for the people of Omega. I get it. Someone has to be their voice in all this. Incredibly powerful forces are about to do battle, with them caught in the middle. I just hope, as we bring down those force fields and go to war, that you can keep the people in mind. Yeah, I tend to agree with you, Zephyr. I think that, um... I think that of the changes they've made in Legendary, I am happy with all but maybe one or two changes. And definitely the sound effect in Firewalker is at the top of the list for least favorite, but um, I can I can think of a couple of things that I would alter in Mass Effect 1, but not, that may just be a learning curve for me, really. It's like the, the changes they made to the guns in Mass Effect 1 made them more like Mass Effect 2 and 3, and going into the game, I, was ex I wasn't expecting that. So, I wasn't treating the guns as though they were different, I was treating them as though the stats change and that's it. But like, their firing methods change, and my brain just... I've played Mass Effect 1 so many times, my brain couldn't switch to that. So that took me a little while. What's your impression of Petrovsky? An adversary worthy of respect. And not just because he's shrewd. When I was starting to organize the Talons, he offered amnesty to anyone who set down their weapon. 
a few of my people surrendered, and he made good on his word. So he has a code. And, as near as I can tell, it doesn't exactly match the elusive man's. Are your people ready for the fight? You needn't worry about the Talons, Shepard. They were thieves and scoundrels once, but they serve with integrity now. We're fighting for a better world. I have to wonder if the same can be said for our Asari friend. I suppose we'll know soon enough. What do you know about the Cerberus force fields? The technology comes from beyond the Omega-4 relay. Flesh disintegrates upon contact. The power required must be enormous. I fear that disrupting it could destabilize other systems on the station. I hope we'll proceed with care and certainty. How did you get mixed up with Arya? I was happy in the Turian military. But when my biotic abilities started to manifest, my superiors saw fit to reallocate me. They practically locked me away. I couldn't use my skills to benefit my people. So I quit. I floated around the galaxy, looking for a new purpose. And you found your way here? More like I lost my way here. But then there was this beautiful, fierce creature who didn't let anyone define her. I'll admit, I was mesmerized. I wanted a little bit of that to rub off on me. How close were you two? The draw was undeniable. Her strengths mirrored my insecurities. Maybe deep down it was the same for her. But trying to be with her turned into trying to be her. Irene Kandros was vanishing. You seem like your own person to me. For all the drama between us? I'm grateful to Arya. She helped me remember who I am. It took a lot to break away from her. But I regret nothing. You're a veteran. Why are you so disturbed by these adjutants? I know fighting Reapers is old hat to you, Commander. But these... What they do to people? They could still be out there. And if they return, I don't want to even think about what would happen to Omega's people. The image of that drives me. And haunts me. I always found it kind of interesting that the Turian military kind of frowns upon biotics. I appreciate it, Nyree. We're heading out soon. I'll be ready. Commander. I guess they see it as cheating, maybe. All right, we'll stick with the weapons we've already got. That seems okay. 13 points, Jesus. Can I, I could probably, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I could almost max out another ability. Maybe I should pick one up. I don't know. Three, lift grenade. at one of the ESO processing plants. It's been powered down, so we'll have to pry open the door. I'll get it. Access to the mine should be on the far side. And the reactor is beyond that? According to the schematics, I ran Omega and Irene. I didn't work the mines myself. No, you had indentured servants for that. Spirits. Relax, they're all Cerberus. They've been ripped to shreds. I don't like this. Yeah, you think as a military as a military force though, they would be excited for biotics because it would give them an edge, but I guess not. None of them have ammo powers. Maybe that's what I'll give myself, is I'll try to give myself incendiary ammo.
more dead. It's a bloodbath. I've got a bad feeling. We shouldn't be... Quiet. What's that sound? An adjutant. Oh no. The general must have locked this place down to keep it inside. I'm pretty sure the, in the original they didn't have an adjutant jump across, or at least if they did, I never saw it. Because that was kind of freaky. The elevator to the mines is through that door. It's deactivated. Then we need to power this place up. There should be a master circuit breaker somewhere. These pipes power the door. We should follow them. Seems new to you too? Yeah, I thought so. Whispering's receding. Maybe the adjutant doesn't like its odds. Don't kid yourself. I've seen one of those things take down a squad of soldiers. Down this ladder. I know how ladders work. Thank you. There's the power control. When this is over, there'll be a lot of repairs to make. I hope you'll focus on the civilian areas first. You are relentless. That's one thing we have in common. Spirit! Unload on it. Wake up! I hate those things. Hate should make you deadlier. That looked like fear to me. All right, back to the door. There's a door back here. Uh -huh. Yeah, they did have the sound effect in the original, but they did not have... Uh, at least I never saw the model. I do remember the sound.
Hook alive. More adjutants. We can't let them escape. Surprised I last that long. We can't let them escape. the elevator again. Stay alert. Tell him I said hey. All right, into the elevator. I'll seal the door. Just in case. On to the mines. What's eating you? Just processing. It's clear the general sealed that area to keep the adjutants in. Along with some unlucky soldiers. Yes. The creatures killed them, but didn't turn them into more adjutants. Can't shake it. Something's off. You're just spooked. Oh. There's okay. a rhythm to this place, Arya. To Cerberus. We'd stuck it out here. Maybe you'd feel it, too. Whatever's in our way, we'll deal with it. You can hear the drills. Damn it. They shouldn't be straining like that. Cerberus must be working them hard. Access to the reactor is somewhere on the upper level. Let's find a way up there.
You know, I'm getting pretty good with this sniper rifle now. I'm liking it more than the uh, than the widow, which says a lot because the black widow is destructive. We can use that maintenance elevator across the way. I will. We need to find an alternate route across. You think? It does have recoil, but the recoil is like 5% what the Black Widow is. It's a very, very small amount. Looks like that goes under the conveyor belt. Like, look at that. It'll burn out in a month. You can't do that with the Black Widow. Stay focused. Yeah, the, um, the reduction in damage in this is so minor compared to all the benefits you get. Like, um, you probably lose, like, 15% damage, but you get uh, faster, re uh, uh, almost, like, 5% recoil, faster reload, uh, faster second shot. Uh, it's just so much more worth it. At least on Insanity, even a Black Widow can't kill a shielded target in one hit.
Yeah, I popped him in the knee and he went down and then his head was like right there. I was like, later sucker. I like the sound my sniper rifle makes when I shoot it. Like for some reason that's supposed to be like impactful. <laughs> Hit the switch. No. They know our target. Expect heavy reinforcements. Just stay focused and find the access point to the reactor. Yeah. <laughs> and shoulders and zentos. Knees and toes. Knees and toes. Actually, this one's knees, head. You are dead. You are dead. Yeah, that's a, Looks that's like a, Cerberus invaded here. Killed everyone. That's a song we learn here, too. Now we're paying them back in kind. I'm sure your dead workers feel much better now. Where do I go from here? Not this way? The elevator to the reactor is across the way. Oh, no. Careful, this place is falling apart. Whose fault is that, Aria? Strange. We're not being attacked anymore. Yep, be ready for anything. started months ago. That wasn't war, babe. That was just warm up. Yeah, because you weren't here, that's why. I find it hard to believe if this turned into a Vermeer situation where you had to choose between saving Arya or Nyrene. I have a hard time uh, believing pretty much anyone would choose Arya over Nyrene. I would choose Nyrene almost every time. I mean... I choose Aria once just to see it, but the every reactor. other time would Straight be my Oh god, this is gonna suck. I hate this part. Looks like we were expected. More like lured. I knew the reactor would be the hard target. I gave you no choice but this route. It's too bad you're on the elusive man's side, Petrovsky. I'm on humanity's side. You're the ones trying to start a war for the glory of Arya. But now it's over. This isn't over until your next of kin can't identify you. I love your bravado. But have the sense to know when you're beaten. You've been neutralized, and I can leave you there to rot. You might as well give up. Never! Arya, what are you thinking? I'm not going out like this. Arya, don't! What the hell is she trying to do? Damn it, Arya, you're forcing my hand. 
This section is hard. Out of the ground.
Stay alive over there. You can't do this, Commander. There's more at stake than you know. That reactor powers life support systems for dozens of wards across the station. Shut it down and thousands of people perish. You hearing this, Arya? Yes, and I don't care. Shut it down! Damn it. Hold tight down there. Rerouting the power to maintain the other systems. Are you crazy? We're almost spent. Irene, watch your flank. This is who you're working for, Shepard. She doesn't care who gets hurt. What are you waiting for? Oh, blow the reactor. She'd just thrown thousands of lives away. Maybe something inside is holding you back. Maybe deep down you're starting to think the galaxy might be better off without her. She's never going to learn. She'll never change. Even if you win, Omega loses. Enough. I've always wondered why Shepard doesn't just turn and shoot those little orbs to get the people to shut up. No, you succeed whether you go Renegade you okay? or Paragon there. I think engineers Despite just get your best it faster. To kill me, your soft heart almost cost me everything. Quiet, Arya. It worked. Shepard saved us without sacrificing innocent lives. I applaud him. I suppose. Whatever. You fought bravely against those mechs in there, Nyreen. Very impressive. But? Why can't you bring that same grit when adjutants attack? It's pathetic. You tense up at the mere mention of those abominations. Lay off. She just saved you. I'm trying to help her, Shepard. Call it tough love. The war's starting. I don't mean to miss it. 
She's never been big on thank yous. Give me a time. Time stamp. Getting reports. All force fields down. Civilians taking to the streets in droves. Cerberus pulling back. That won't last. The people don't have the training to go up against Cerberus front lines. They'll be wiped out. Civilian casualties can't be avoided. You'll have to accept this. Say what you will, Arya. I won't allow senseless deaths. Do what you can to protect them. Of course, Commander. Arya, right here. Report. My team is scouting the maintenance tunnels. We've encountered Cerberus forces escorting engineers. They're moving gear. Look to be setting explosives to the station's central support columns. Bray, engage. Delay them as long as you can. We're coming. Got it. Roll out, people. If they detonate the main column, they'll cut off the way to afterlife. The Talon offensive will be stopped cold. So we split up? Yes. Nyreen, lead the frontal assault. Shepard and I will meet you in the markets after we've taken care of those bombs. Of course. But don't count on me building your memorials if you get yourselves killed. I like it when you're feisty. The only route to the central column is through the tunnels. Don't let them through. Turn around, damn it. My leg is itchy. your ass away from me. Sure. I Let's go somewhere else. All right.
extend the dam in the control room. That should get us across. Let's go. 